Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Carried Away. Thank you as always for your tremendous support. This series has been wonderful so far. And again, 2,000 likes and we'll have another daily episode tomorrow. But let's get into this. I've got my eye on three levels, okay? We've missed one up the top here. It's going to be a very difficult one, so we'll probably do that last. Then there are two levels I really want to do. Uh, I want to do a drag lift one, you know I like those. And look at that, that's different isn't it? There's some sort of combo going on over here, so I am really excited to see that. In fact, although these are locked, you can look down here and see what the future ones are. So number 10 is going to be a combo as well. Let's jump into this drag lift level and let's see what kind of challenge awaits us. Okay, we've got to go up over there and down to the other side. Do you know what? This looks kind of simple to get the... Well, to get the level done, now that I think about it actually, that blue star is kind of high, right? So you pretty much have to make a ramp to go from here up to there. Let's try and judge it like that. Do you know what be really nice is if I could keep building this thing? I'm aiming over here so we have the right kind of slope to go up there. And actually that looks really steep, doesn't it? <laughs> we might have to work our way onto this slope a little bit. So we can have that to get them on top of this thing, but if we want to get the blue star, this is the point really, isn't it? We need to go higher up, like that. And then, then you've got to ask yourself, now where does the next bit go? Do we just go straight down like this? Because if we weren't going for that blue star, you'd anchor up on here, drag them across there, and have a nice little bridge from that point to the other. Hmm. Yeah, so I think we're going to go for the blue star this one. I also think it might be advisable to actually do this again. Here, here's my thinking, here's my thinking. We've got to build some sort of tower down here, right? This tower's going to have a wheel on it. And the reason we're doing that is so that we can bring this parallel to the ramp that we've built. But if we put the, bit, if we put the ramp further back, then it's already going to be parallel to it. So that's probably not going to hold out. This middle bit here I reckon will buckle, but if we look at the distance here, it's pretty good. I am slightly worried that it might actually be too much for the rider, right? Like there's too big of a gap there. So that's my fault if that happens. Then up the top here you can see I haven't actually built this bit parallel to the top here, so I need to change that. This thing actually needs to go flat to about here and then come down parallel with what's above it which I'll change up in the future. That's all going to fall apart though, so let's remove that connection and just test the beginning bit and find out, well... I mean, I did say that was going to happen, didn't I? <laughs> let's try and learn something from the bottom bit over here because not all of it fell apart. In fact, let's disconnect those parts and just see what happens to the rider here. Okay, it looks like actually that's going to be absolutely fine. There has actually been a ton of trial and error that I'm just going to skip out of this video. Um, so you can see that it kind of like holds itself together at the moment, right? But it wobbles a lot as well. Now there are a ton of connections all over the place. We're still under budget by how much? Another 600 to go or something. And there's a lot of stuff going on here. One thing is that I'm stacking the, the supports with the jumps as well. So on both sides, it all looks pretty good. And let's see this thing in action. Where is our rider? We're going to press F1 and zoom in on this fella. It looks like he's having a pleasant old time going up the drag lift. I've got to say, it's pretty crazy this structure, right? But I like the way that we've done this. It feels like we were supposed to use the other structures more because they gave us lots of those anchor points, right? And down we go the other side. Ah. <laughs> Oh no, do you spot what the problem is? When I put a support beam thing there, we're not actually stacking it, we're replacing it. Oh, that's useless. Right, so watch what happens when there isn't those supports there. These things ain't strong enough, basically. Okay, can you connect? There we go. And it falls apart. <laughs> it falls apart. So they gave us these things, right? But these don't connect to those, so I can't connect a foundation... Well, sorry, a support to the foundation and a log won't connect to this stuff. So that thing is entirely useless. Those things are literally for doing this, which we managed to do with one. So I think if we look at how close this is, I think it might not be a bad idea to just create a support down here. We're just out of range. Let's do a little triangle shape like that. Maybe that'll give it enough support. That's going to wobble though on either side, isn't it? So I tried to make this thing nice and elegant and now it's just looking kind of ridiculous, wouldn't you say? That should do the trick. Yep, holds it all in place. 
And with that there, you might not need so many of these other supports because they were kind of holding the bridge together better. You know? You know? <laughs> Let's speed this thing up. I think we got this, peeps. I think we got it under budget and in the bag. And it's not the most elegant thing you've ever seen, but it's a draglift level and I enjoy these. And we got all the way over to the other side and off goes our rider, who we can now control and make jump and do flips and... And see you later, buddy. <laughs> see you later. You're back at the beginning. Awesome. Right, another level done. Let's go check out what one we're going to do next. Should we do the combo since it's already highlighted? I think we will. I think like an intermediate level is what I need right now. Not too much of a challenge. Okay, so what is going... I built something. Undo. Undo. I'm trying to, trying to zoom in, trying to look at what's going on. This is... This was a combo, right? Do I have to build the stations? Wow. We get to build our own stations this time. So I'm guessing this is going to be centered around these flags. You've got to get them from one location to another. It doesn't really state where the start is. Or maybe the start is there then. Yeah, and there's a rider there. Okay then. So, but we've got two lots of these. We've got three things to build. Goodness me. So we're going to use all three of these options, but I think in reality, you don't actually have to use... Ah, maybe this is why we have a choice then. I was just about to say, let's undo that. It doesn't feel like you really need to use all three. We're going to do a drag lift from here to there, and then I was going to do a ski lift from here to there, and then the gondola from this bit to the next. I mean, that might be just complete overkill at this point. It really feels like it's overkill. So maybe we don't actually have to use all the different types. They're just, they've given us an option and we get to pick what we want. So actually I'm going to undo those two. We're going to do the drag lift going across that little ledge. And then from here, I think we can get all the way up the top there with just a regular chair lift. So this bridge isn't pretty nice to look at, is it? In fact, it's pretty awful to look at. Before they give it a test run and uh, this chappy getting stuck right at the very beginning. I mean, that's not very helpful. I think what we've got to do is delete this <laughs> or, or just move it which is that an option here it is it is let's move it hmm what's that slider about oh oh there's more options is there well can we move it there and will you get on it no you won't of course you won't you're going to be difficult aha there we go grabs straight onto it gets pulled over here Excellent. Oh, now you're having trouble getting on the bridge, are you? Nope. You, you don't go across it face first. That's not how you do this. Okay, looks like we've got to just adjust that and give it a nicer transition. Awesome. Also, that drag lift kind of flexes pretty low, doesn't it? It's because I've moved that. I based it off its original position. Now it's a lot lower. But it's going to bring the rider across, and that's the most important thing, I think, right? Okay, so you're across. Now, will you continue going? Because you're only going to have so much momentum. Right, so this thing needs to be lowered and pushed back as well. That's interesting. In fact, that's probably why we have those things behind it, right? If I click on this and I add one of those, is that going to move them across automatically? I've got a feeling it will. Let's speed this thing up. All the way, come on. <laughs> there you are. And, hey, there you go. Gives it a little boost. Right, so now it's on the platform and ready to go. So our next challenge is to take that up there. Like quite steep and then go all the way across up to this space. I didn't build the end of this. Apparently that's kind of a problem if you ask me. Let's put the end of it right there. I'm hoping that they'll be able to roll off the edge. Which is nice. And if we put that there you can see. Yep we're going to need a few supports to make this work. So I reckon we need something kind of immediate here at the front. And I'm wondering if we can get away with this. Kind of looks like it might be a little bit problematic, but that nudges it up a little bit. Maybe not high enough for the tree. Look how high it can go, though. If we nudge it in small increments like that, we can push the thing the whole way across. So I, I kind of feel like the furthest out is probably the strongest for that as well. You know, so... I mean, we can see... Yeah, it falls down. <laughs> uh, we can see that's doing all right, so we need another one further up. This feels like really easy now, all of a sudden. Because all we've got to do is build a similar thing again from here to there. Now, can we have these things go through the rocks? I think we've learned that they can't do that. Okay, they're going to have to be a little bit wider. Or maybe we make the next support somewhere else. Maybe up here. Maybe we can get away with that. That looks super risky, but I like it. Let's speed this thing up as well. Oh, it, it broke straight away. Now, why would it break straight away? Hang on a second. I guess, I guess the slack through the chair into the rock. So that's kind of awful, isn't it? Okay, I think I'm going to get rid of this. And we're going to have to build something around here. 
Alright, this thing here is going to be put under the test, I reckon. Doesn't look terribly strong, does it? If I had the tension turned off this entire time, I have. That's not good. We can see how rubbish this bridge is now. I think we've only got one rider to get across all of this as well. So how far under budget are we? Only just. Yeah, I don't think you were ever supposed to build all three of the different things. But we've gone for two of them and probably maybe could have got away with just one, you know. Anyway, let's speed this up a little bit because it's taking its time. There you go. You're on. You're over the tree. You're wobbling back and forth. And now you're going to go very close to this rock, aren't you? But you're just over it. That's fantastic. This thing's holding out and it looks like we've done this level. I've also left those two in there, which I should have deleted because those cost money. But we did almost everything with the stars. Collect. There was a star. And I said stars, I meant medal. <laughs> Where was the star? Is it high up in the sky? Where is it? I don't... Hang on a second. This ain't right. Where's the star? Peeps, I feel like we've been wrongly done by. Leave a comment down below and let me know if you know where the star is. Have I done something stupid like built this thing directly over the top of it? Uh, what's going on with you, buddy? You're having a bad time. <laughs> You're having a bad time. Let's move on to the next level. Let's move on to the next one, which is going to be in the previous area. So now we're going to do one that's going to be very difficult. It is Yon's Step. It is a ski lift level. Let's check out what challenge awaits us here. We've got to go... Ooh. <laughs> now that is interesting. We've got to go all the way up and get both of those stars. That's the challenge, really. Otherwise, it's a regular ski lift. So if we want to go sort of in range of those stars directly from here, we're going to be too close to those trees. This is going to be quite a challenge, I think. We also can't build any additional supports where we would like to. And we can also build ramps. I don't know how that would be helpful. This is going to be literally my first attempt trying this. I can't help but feel those two need a connection. Let's put a rope between them. And will that actually hold out? Well, the first thing that happened was something broke. <laughs> That's going to tumble down the hill. Oh, why did that break? That was kind of unexpected. Oh, there's a lot of tension there on that one. Right, so we're building behind this thing. which makes it a real pain, you know. So building behind here is tricky. If we do that, you can see the selection that I've made. However, I did just move these things around. If I undo a couple of times, you'll see how much of a mess it was. So they weren't actually connected. So now they're connected and you'll see that eventually something gives way. A couple of things gave way at the same time. It's going to be very difficult to support because of this thing back here. The other option is to use the rope to hold something that's sort of being pulled against by this cable, but I don't really feel too confident about doing that, you know? I don't think my skills at building these things are that good. Let's give that some extra support. I should probably turn the grid off as well. Okay, the other two bits to break were over here and up there. Tons of reinforcements all over the place, and I'm wondering, hey, this thing might not be necessary anymore, but then I noticed something. Which is the chairlift. Let's let's look at the chairlift. Um, it, it goes on the roof and it hits the roof and that causes a problem. <laughs> it flips it upside down, which is no good whatsoever. Uh, the rider's coming up here. No, he's not. He's going down the tree. Never mind. Oh, that looks so painful. Your poor old knees. I wonder if the next one will get up. No, you're sort of brushing it as well. Oh, no, you're over. Okay. Okay, it's now Asuma's torture ski lift. Let's see what happens to you. So land on the roof. Get pulled backwards. Oh, will you survive? Oh my god! <laughs> now, if the first one had made it across, imagine if it did that. Oh, that's absolutely amazing. That is absolutely amazing. I wish that the first one had made it across. There's two of them stuck in the tree. <laughs> oh, if we adjust this one ever so slightly, we might be able to pull that off with them doing a flip. <laughs> Yay, we did the level. Oh... Okay, let's try and do it without killing any riders. We also didn't collect all the stars, so we missed this one. We never actually got that. I'm done with this one, peeps. There's just too many beams here to manage. I've been wiggling them about for ages, and then I've just started putting them all over the place for the fun of it. Now, wouldn't it be bizarre if that worked? Let's put a connection there. <laughs> that puts us over budget. It's not. It's going gonna, it's gonna to break. What I tell you? It's going to break. <laughs> 
Oh, you were thinking it might work. No. Alright, we're going to end it on that. We've done the level. We didn't do it with all the stars, but I've just spent way too long. I looked at the clock and I went, goodness me, I've got a problem with this game. As you know, though, 2,000 likes. We'll have another episode tomorrow. Thank you as always for your support, and I'll see you soon with some more. I was going to say Polybridge. <laughs> it's carried away. Goodness me.